Hi, this is a quick video to show you how to install the Facebook Likes Extractor as bookmarks rather than as a Chrome extension. If your bookmarks bar isn't showing, then click on the little three dots in the top right hand corner of Chrome, click on bookmarks and click on show bookmarks bar. Next thing we want to do is to open up the bookmarks manager. So again, click on the little three dots, click on bookmarks and click on bookmark manager and you'll see this page. Now go back to the readme file that was in the download that you had and copy the first piece of JavaScript code Go back to your browser click on the organize button and click on add page Then here we're going to call this a likes page and in the URL box we're going to paste the code that we've just copied and press enter to save Go back to the readme file and copy the second piece of JavaScript code. Again, click on the Organize button, click on Add Page, and for this one we're going to call it Links Extractor. And in the URL box, paste the code we've just copied and press Enter. And you'll see the two new buttons have been added to your bookmarks bar. Now if we go back to Facebook and we go onto someone's profile that you want to search through the likes for, Click on the Likes page, and if they let other people view their likes, then it'll take you to the Likes page. Next thing we want to do is just click on the Likes Extractor button, and enter the keywords that we're interested in. So we want to search this person's likes for keywords related to the law enforcement niche. So in this case, we're typing Law, Sheriff, Police, and so on, then click OK. And the Facebook Likes Extractor will do as it's done in the other videos. It'll scroll down the page, look at all the page likes that they have, and try and match them up against the keywords that you've entered. When it's done that, it'll save, it'll create a, a text file for you that you can either open or save to your computer. And this file will contain all of the pages that this person follows uh, that relate to the keyword that you're interested in. So you can just copy and paste this directly into Audience Insights and find out if you can target those pages or not. The principle is exactly the same for, for Firefox, so I'll show you how to do that now in there. We'll just bring up the Firefox browser. In this case, we want to click on this little icon, uh, go to Bookmarks Toolbar, and View Bookmarks Toolbar. In this case, we've already got it opened. So again, go back to the text file, in the download that you had. Copy the first piece of JavaScript. You can go through the menus again as well as a quick shortcut to add bookmarks. So if you just right click on the bookmarks bar and click on new bookmark and we can call this likes page and in the location tab, sorry the location text box, paste in the code that you've just copied and click on add. Do the same for the second piece of code. Right click on the toolbar again, click on new bookmark and call it likes extractor or whatever you choose and then paste in the code that you've just copied again. And you'll now see these two buttons up here on the Firefox toolbar. So again, if we're on this person's page that we're interested in looking at, click on the likes page. It'll take you to the likes page and click on likes extractor and type in the keywords that you're interested in again. And so on. And click OK. And again, exactly the way that it did it previously, it'll scroll through their likes page and it'll try and match pages that they follow uh, with the keywords that you've entered. And once it's done that, it'll create a text file of all the pages that it's found, which you can then open up and copy and paste into Audience Insights. I hope that's helped you and please let me know if you've got any questions. Thank you. Bye.